What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another segment of All Things Consciousness. See, and Shauna will be talking about inner childhood wounding, inner childhood trauma, and healing. These are the deep, unresolved issues that we have had from childhood up until now that have shaped us in ways that we may not recognize. Wondered why in relationships they might not work out, uh, whether it's romantic or friendships, think them from these inner child wounds. When I grew up, it was children to be seen and not heard because especially little boys, little boys are taught that they're not allowed to cry or you're a sissy. And God forbid, you know, my mother wanted me to dress girly. I was a tomboy. I didn't want to. I couldn't be myself. And I was silenced. Of thinking that we have to mask who we really are to fit in or to people please and hugs I love kisses I love things like that I get a lot of that when I was younger because of my mom's trauma I grew up in a household where my father was absent seeking it from outside sources which could show up as being promiscuous which could show up as being clingy to others you know you're not gonna be gay and have us look bad so then we were allowed to be hit with a switch, with a chew, with a spoon, grew up was very physical, hands on. That's all I knew was fighting and arguing. It was physical abuse, which honestly, that's what I experienced. Um, like she said, I experienced be silent. You can't take these things into your relationship. That's why we keep pushing heal, heal, heal. There are three types of childhood neglect, right? <clears throat> and there's emotional neglect, psychological neglect. In physical neglect to deal with emotions, help you know, like healthy. I, I I developed cancer because I was stuffing my emotions down. I didn't know how to to um, express myself. For me in the pieces when these people would leave or these people would quote unquote abandon me as I thought. It, I was in a whole cult because of this. So, bullied throughout middle school throughout high school every time that you realize that you're being triggered in something one that's showing you a wound another part of healing is do the things that you used to do when you were younger and you love look through and always have that childlike wonderment and and your life and just allow things to flow to you love y'all hope y'all enjoyed it if y'all have any questions or anything drop them below have a good day take care guys it's caught in a...